Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be the second installment in the Box Fight Basics series. The first video is already out and it will be linked in the description below if you guys are interested. I go over the Bucky ramp in that video. But in today's video, I'm going to be explaining to you guys why you guys want to get like the right hand, your opponent, on the right of your box. So I'm going to show you guys what I mean. So in this situation in Box Fight Maps, it's quite common where you have an opponent kind of like on a diagonal from, from you. So what you want to do is you actually want to force your opponent to be the one like on the right of their box instead of you being on like this left wall trying to get a peek on them and the reason for this is if i'm over here and he's over there i can actually hit him for free without him being able to see me at all whereas if i'm over here trying to get like a shot at him thinking i have the right hand peek i actually don't so in order to do, to do this you actually do have to be like hyper pretty aggressive because you want to force your opponent to be on the defensive and be holding this wall so you can be the one attacking on your right hand because if you don't do that they're probably going to try and do the same thing and force you uh, force their attack on the right hand. So, this is something I notice a lot of players doing. I notice a lot of players who have this open thinking they have a right hand peek, but they really don't because it's pretty easy for me to go ahead and hit them just like that. So, yeah, that's really it. There's a reason this series is called the Box Fight Basics. But with that being said, that's going to be all for today's video. Just a little note on angles in Box Fight Maps. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. And if you enjoy my content, subscribe to my channel. Uh, right down below.